Hey man, I'm a struggling musician. I mean, I've completed grade 8 rock school guitar and grade 7 rock school drums. I'm a self-taught bass player and piano player and I went to the Juilliard School of Music for piano when I was 9. I went to the Berkeley School of Music for my college for bass and the Manhattan School of Music after that to pursue both jazz theory and music production. But my friends and I are struggling to make a name for ourselves in the music industry. And it's just so hard. What should I do? Should I play my scales for eight hours instead of six? Should I do more metronomic meditation? Um, I don't know what to do, man. Can you please help us? What, you think you can become big in the music industry through practice? Oh man, I feel so sad for you guys. You know what? I'm gonna show you guys how to really write a hit song. Hey guys, my name is Incompetent Seller and today I'm going to show you guys a technique to write a song that is guaranteed to become a hit. Okay man, I'm ready. I have my digital audio workstation Traction 7. I can pan sounds left and right, easily control the automation, increase gain and levels and change them all in individual clips. But is that enough? Should I upgrade to Ableton Live Suite for 60,000 rupees? I mean, I know it's expensive, but... If it's worth it, I guess I can live on one serving of brown rice every day for a year. What? No. I'm gonna work on GarageBand. Anyway, for the actual song, first, let's take a look at the drums. Okay, I'm ready. Uh, I have my drum kit right over here. Um, I can write the sheet music down. I have my manuscript booked ready. <laughs> what? You think we're actually gonna play the drums or something? What an idiot. Oh, okay, so we're gonna program the drums? No, that takes way too much time. Wait, then how? Oh, we can take royalty-free drum beats that other people have made and use it in our own song. Oh, got it. And using these royalty-free beats, we can improvise over it and kind of transform it into something more interesting. Why does the drum beat have to be interesting? So we can just choose any drum preset. Yes. This is the one. Drag and drop that guy in here. Extend him for the entire length of the song. Okay, so now that we have the drums under our belt, let's move on to the bass. Okay, so how exactly are we gonna start this? Are we gonna have the bass playing with the kick drum and locking in with the kick drum? Are we gonna have the bass only on the off beats? Ooh, maybe accented snare hits? Okay, you have got to stop thinking. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. No, this is how we're going to choose the bass. Nice. Copy paste that for the entire length of the song. And yeah, so now we have our drums and bass. Sounds like this. Okay, so using this really difficult technique of randomly picking and choosing, we can add a lot more layers to our song like synths and just random electronic stuff. Copy paste. Nice, nice. I like it. So you might be wondering, what will the other part be? Don't we need to change it up? No. We don't. We can use the same thing and when the vocals change, it gives the illusion like the song is taking a turn. But it isn't. Okay, now we move on to the vocals. Yes, finally, something we can't just program and guess. Yup, you're right. We don't do the guessing anymore. We let the computer do the guessing for us. God. Song lyrics generator. Choose what you would think would make the other person the most uncomfortable. Now that we have our vocal lyrics, rap lyrics, it's time to move on to the actual vocals and we're gonna record them now. Wait a second, you said record, not look up online, not use royalty free, not make a robot do it. You said record? Yup, we're just gonna record it. We're gonna record ourselves singing the lyrics without any sense of tune or rhythm. Okay, so now I'm recording the vocals. And um, you don't really need any particular tune or rhythm. We can just kind of do that in like the editing process. So um, for now, I'm just going to kind of do it with the kind of tone that I want to hear, which is kind of like whispery. So 
Yeah, let's do it. I heard there was a secret heart that no one cared about. And then we just cut up the vocals to match the rhythm and alter the vocal pitch to match the harmony. So what you want to do is go to bed at 9 in the night. Next morning, wake up at 1.30 after setting a really loud alarm. You're going to be sleepy, you're going to be irritated, you're going to be tired. And that's perfect. Then I want you to go to wherever the clothes hang in your house. Take on the clothes pins, put them on your nose. For kind of the pain so that you get even more irritated and so that you really get that nasal kind of effect, you know what I'm saying? Then you go downstairs and run 10 miles. Once you run 10 miles, you come back up and immediately go to wherever you record, take the random lyrics. And without further ado, may I present you with the future number one hit, Like a Beautiful Heart. People, it's time. But people, I, but people begin. Straight out of the beautiful dirt of the world. Do you have a job, deep but up a night? I never flip your hair, cut to flip your hair in the vivid out of the night. Be underwater, the girl, I've been the fight. I think of love when I'm in the New York state of mind. Hope the light cuts the night. By its I don't like the dirty bite. I think of love when I'm in the New York state of mind. I get my secret heart That no one cared about But you don't really have a pulse I get my secret heart That no one cared about but you don't really have a pulse yeah. Yeah. But you don't really have a pulse But you don't really 